together. Welcome to Watch Mojo. And today we're counting down the top 10 smartest decisions in Saw movies. For this list, we'll be looking at the smartest decisions that were made throughout the Saw franchise. Are you smart enough to think of these? Let us know in the comments below. Number 10. Allison Frees Herself Saw The Gordons are a pretty darn smart family. Not only does Lawrence prove one of Jigsaw's survivors, but his wife Allison effectively frees herself from Zep's control. Allison and her daughter Diana are held captive by Zep, who is ordered to take them out if Lawrence doesn't do the same to Adam. Dr. Gordon's time is up. Now I've got to do what I've got to do, and I'm afraid it has to be you that tells him he failed. Quite the resourceful woman, Allison managed to free herself from the binds, and in an act of extraordinary intelligence and forward thinking, she pretended to remain tied up. When Zepp returned to execute Allison, she sprung her trap and wrestled the gun away from Zepp. Larry? Holly? You failed. Following a brief struggle, Allison stabs Zepp in the leg with a pair of scissors, buying her time to be saved by Detective Tap. <laughs> Number 9. Allison Shoots at the Closet – Saw 3 Allison Gordon is not to be confused with Allison Carey, a homicide detective working on the Jigsaw case alongside Detective Tap. Unfortunately, Allison became a victim of Amanda, who rigged her trap to be inescapable. You. Right before she was abducted, Allison realized that she was being filmed from a hidden camera in her closet. After seeing herself on the TV screen, Allison quickly grabbed her gun and shot through the closet door, believing an assailant to be hiding inside. It was very quick thinking on her part, and a very smart move. Unfortunately, there was no one in the closet, and she was ambushed by a pig mask and taken to her fatal trap. <laughs> Number 8. Tossing in Amanda – Saw 2 Serving as one of the main antagonists of Saw 2, Xavier was an aggressive drug dealer who was framed by Detective Matthews. Right now, you're going in there. I'll kill you where you stand. His personal test inside the nerve gas house was to dig through hundreds of used needles to find a key that unlocked a metal door. Behind the door was the antidote to the nerve gas. Not wanting to dig through the pit himself, Xavier picked up Amanda and tossed her in. <laughs> it wasn't a very nice gesture, to say the least, but it was pretty smart on his part. The plan actually worked as Amanda dug through the needle pit and was successful in finding the key. It was only Xavier's bungling at the door that prevented him from obtaining the antidote. No, 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 no. No! Number 7. Brad and Ryan Team Up – Saw 3D You know what they say about bros? Brad, Ryan, and Dina are abducted by Mark Hoffman and taken to a hardware store. Dina was secretly dating both men, and their traps served to conclude the love triangle in a dastardly and deadly manner. She is toxic, and today, all of your transgressions will be made public. Brad and Ryan were forced to push saw blades into each other's chests, the stronger man obviously proving the victor. However, Dina makes the very stupid decision to encourage both men, reaffirming her love for both and telling each to take out the other. You love him? No! no. Oh, you love him more than me? No! I have faith I've always loved you! Realizing they are still being played, even in the midst of a life-or-death trap, Brad and Ryan decide to spare each other and sacrifice Dina to the saw. No pun intended. I think we're breaking up with you, Dina. No! No! Ah! 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 Number 6. Hoffman Tricks Strom – Saw 5 Hello, Agent Strom. If you are hearing this, then you have once again found what you are looking for. 
Or so you think. Peter Strom is an FBI agent who was thwarted by Hoffman in the famous glass coffin trap. The trap was set by Hoffman and seemed deceptively straightforward. Simply climb inside the coffin and live. Strom doesn't, and Hoffman soon intervenes, preventing Strom from hearing the rest of his tape. The two engage in a brief physical struggle, and Hoffman is pushed inside the glass coffin. While inside, he gloatingly gestures to the tape recorder, which asks if Strom trusts Hoffman. I ask you, Special Agent Strom, have you learned enough to trust me? As the tape plays, the glass coffin is lowered into a secret compartment in the floor while the walls of the room slowly close in around Strom, eventually crushing him. We guess he should have trusted him after all. Number 5. Daniel Plays Dead Saw 2 Xavier has nothing on Daniel Matthews. <laughs> Daniel! After finding the dilapidated bathroom from the first movie, both Daniel and Amanda realize that there is no way out and that they will soon be accosted by the now psychotic Xavier, who is hot on their heels. To trick Xavier, Daniel pretends to be dead while Amanda keeps up with the ruse. A ruse we were sure she was happy to undergo, considering what Xavier did to her earlier in the film. All I want is the number in the back of his neck. Just as Xavier approaches Amanda, Daniel springs up, kicks him in the shin, and puts a hacksaw to effective use. Daniel certainly has a good heart, and as it turns out, he's also quite the badass as well. <laughs> Number 4. Hoffman Survives the Bear Trap – Saw 6 Mark Hoffman becomes a victim of his own games in Saw 6 when he is approached and incapacitated by Jill Tuck, who outfits him with an inescapable version of the reverse bear trap. Immediately after Jill leaves him for dead, Mark manages to break his own hand with the trap and frees himself from his restraints. Thinking very quickly, Mark makes the genius decision to stick the trap between two metal bars in the door window, effectively preventing the trap from springing all the way open. The bear trap shreds his right cheek, but Hoffman survived the ordeal, eventually making his way to an abandoned hangar to stitch up his gaping wound. Number 3. Gordon Cauterizes His Wound – Saw 3D the end of the first saw famously sees Gordon hacking off his own foot with a provided hacksaw to escape his shackle and find help. The movie ends on an ambiguous note, with viewers quite literally left in the dark regarding Gordon's fate. Game over. <laughs> Fans were finally provided an answer in Saw 3D, and said answer was quite genius on Gordon's part. Shortly after crawling out of the bathroom, Gordon cauterizes his bleeding foot stump on a steaming pipe. <laughs> The pain caused Gordon to pass out, but the cauterization was nevertheless successful. Congratulations, Dr. Gordon. You survived. He was soon found by Jigsaw, who treated the wound and outfitted Gordon with a prosthetic. Number 2. Simone Amputates Her Arm – Saw 6 Simone was a victim of the brutal pound of flesh trap, alongside her overweight business partner, Eddie. Listen, whatever you do, don't lean forward. What's this? What's, what's no! going on? The two were outfitted with some type of deadly head device and tasked with cutting off pieces of themselves. The person who accrued the most flesh would win, and the other would die via the head device. Who will offer the most flesh in order to save their life? The choice is yours. Eddie begins cutting off strips from his stomach. Simone is much smaller than Eddie, but also much smarter. She wraps a tourniquet around her arm and cuts it off with a provided meat cleaver. The entire arm was obviously heavier than Eddie's stomach flesh, and Simone survived. Before we unveil our top pick, here are a few honorable mentions. Staging Perez's death, Saw 6. Perez faked her death, and she went into hiding. It was my call, detective. I knew the jigsaw wasn't working alone, but until I knew for certain who was helping him, I couldn't guarantee her well-being. Emily uses her children. Saw 6. Emily pleads with Easton using her kids, effectively saving her life. No, I have two kids! You don't look well! Please, 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 I can't get 
everyone without me. They hate me. Mark Hoffman uses a human shield. Saw 6. Hoffman uses Sachi to protect himself from Perez's gunfire. Logan tricks Halloran. Jigsaw. Logan fakes his death to coerce a confession from Halloran. You're working with Halloran. I am him. Anna jams the bike. Jigsaw. Anna briefly saves Mitch by stopping the motorcycle powering the blade. Before we continue, be sure to subscribe to our channel and ring the bell to get notified about our latest videos. You have the option to be notified for occasional videos or all of them. If you're on your phone, make sure you go into your settings and switch on notifications. Number 1. Strom gives himself windpipe surgery. Saw 5. Hoffman may have gotten one over on Strom, but that doesn't change the fact that Strom performed the smartest act in the entire Saw franchise, not to mention one of the ballsiest. For his test, Strom's head was placed inside a glass cube, which quickly filled with water. Once water completely filled the cube and submerged Strom, he took a pen from his pocket and stabbed himself in the throat, successfully performing a tracheotomy on himself. It allowed Strom to breathe underwater, and it bought him enough time to be saved by the arriving paramedics. It's amazing what the mind and body are capable of when in life-ending distress. How'd you walk out of that building? How did you? On a gurney with a f***ing hole in my throat. Do you agree with our picks? Check out this other recent clip from WatchMojo, and be sure to subscribe and ring the bell to be notified about our latest videos.